Browns fans, Nathan Zagura here with a game preview edition of the Two Minute Drill brought to you by University Hospitals. The Browns four and two. The Cardiac Kids back after back to back last second wins over the 49ers and the Colts. They head to the Pacific Northwest to take on the four and two Seattle Seahawks, who are coming off of a win over the Arizona Cardinals last week. It's a very good football team. On offense, they're led by the AP Comeback Player of the Year, quarterback Geno Smith. He went to the Pro Bowl last year for them. He set franchise records in completion percentage and in passing yards. And frankly, he did something that hadn't been done in a long time. Since 1999, became the first quarterback since Rich Gannon to go to a Pro Bowl after being in the league for more than a decade. So it's been a renaissance for him, and he's got some talented players around him. At the wide receiver position, they've got DK Metcalf, who was a first-team All-Pro a couple of years ago. He's got 1,000-yard seasons under his belt. Tyler Lockett has multiple 1,000-yard seasons under his belt, and they used their first-round pick this year, 20th overall, on Jackson Smith in Jigba out of the Ohio State University, and he had his first career touchdown and a career high in receiving yards just last week. If there's a weakness to the Seahawks team, it is their offensive line, and I think the Browns' defensive line should be able to dominate, control the line of scrimmage in the run game, and then pin their ears back and get after Geno Smith in the pass game. When the Seahawks are on defense, they're going to play a lot of big nickel or dime with three safeties on the field. Jamal Adams is back, and since he's been back, they have been the number one defense in the NFL in terms of yards per game. They have Adams, the Pro Bowler Quandry Diggs, as well as Julian Love. They can get after the quarterback. They lost their top pass rusher, Nuoso, to a pec injury last Last week, but they still can get after the quarterback. Couple guys with four sacks on the roster. Jaron Reed, Boye Mafe has four straight games with at least one sack. And then they've got great corners. Last year's rookie went to the Pro Bowl, had six picks. Reek Woolen. On the other side, they got Devin Witherspoon, the fifth overall pick in this year's draft, and he has been sensational so far. So PJ Walker and the Browns, they got to take care of the football. They got to protect. We got to get the ground game going. And when there are opportunities to make plays through the air, we have got to be able to capitalize on them. It's going to be a tough one. Full coverage for you starting at 1030 on News 5 with Browns Countdown. And then at four hours prior to kickoff, we're going to have the radio going on the University Hospitals Cleveland Browns radio network leading up till kickoff when it'll be Chris Rose, myself, and Gerard Cherry on the call. This has been a game preview edition of the Two Minute Drill brought to you by University Hospitals.